taped to the headboard of my bed are pictures of everyone who ever disappeared. Painted on the ceiling are the faces of my family. They keep my dreams strong. On the mahogany bookshelf rest all the life stories of all my friends, some shorter than others, some unfinished. Cracking beneath the surface of the desk is my timeline, pain running through the years, but always showing more smiles than tears. Antoinette, it is beautiful, but let me tell you something. But what? You read this page, and then you have to go back to this page to read something else. Because and then so you right. go back to this page, you read this, and then you back three back pages back here to read the rest of it. Why don't you just rewrite it so because it's this, one poem? Because this book is my book. This is book that I, I use. I hope it's like, yours. But I'm saying, no, this is me. This is this is mine, and no one sees this. So well, the way I, I think I a journal is usually a place where you can mess up in. Like, you don't have to worry about, like, showing it to your anyone and you know like you can mess up it's okay but most people don't realize that and they get really intimidated by a page but you just kind of gotta jump in and do it because i'm thinking about this poetry that i've seen right well how you sing poetry it's not for no beat it's for me and i'm trying to get the nobel peace mm. i'm trying to stop everybody you see because the peace is not around me why is peace is not around me? Cause y'all don't want peace. But I want these streets to hear that I'm free. And I'm free. You're hecka scared when you first do poetry. You're like, my hands be shaking. My hands still be shaking. I gotta like wear gloves so people don't like, oh, they're acting up. So people don't see cause it's so scary. Public speaking is the number one fear ever. People would rather die. Oh Bulgaria, Bulgaria, oh Bulgaria, I was born into a world some may never understand, a world not European, not Turkish, not African. I was born into a place where when you make mistakes you're slapped on the hand, but you cannot see who did it. A world where your own words are measured in small, golden certificates, each one saying I love you and only you. I remember the first day we had this fantastic woman come in with a great laugh. Her name was Elizabeth, and she was a writer's court teacher. And she asked the 10 young women, and we were pretty feisty and um, kind of hardcore girls at the time, to just write. And there were no rules, and there were no periods, and there was no grammar, and there was no spelling. And I think that that was the first time ever that I had abandoned my fear of writing. Cause Yo soy Nicoya, con mis memorias te contaré la historia de mi gente. Trabajador y decente que lleva en la mente siempre ir hacia el frente. Muchos pinoleros dejaron nuestra tierra buscando la manera de brillar en su carrera. Otros huyeron de la guerra y la miseria, refugiándose bajo la bandera de la barra y las estrellas, tratando de olvidar todas sus tragedias. Aunque digan que estoy loco, que me patina el coco, yo no me desenfoco y sigo poco a poco. Tu conciencia te toco, por eso yo te digo, no dejes en el olvido a tu suelo querido. Indian culture has a mix of colors and mix of taste and that will also reflect in the poetry too. All the colors, all the taste and that's how the life is supposed to be because some days are joyful, some days are sorrowful, some days are normal and that's what it's all about. Those were the best times of our lives, sleeping in vacant cars and still waking up the next day with a smile on our face. You see, the material things never mattered to us. We just wanted to live until the next day. And you know what? The judges can keep their scores because their numbers can't reflect what I've been through. Not even this piece can define me. So you see, I don't need pity. I just need y'all to help me finish this piece because the rest is still unwritten.